Hello, dinky do everybody. It's just me, Scotty McClue. And uh, nothing has passed me, of course. It's great to have you on. And a very good evening to you. Quick live pop-up for you. And uh, I thought we'd say hi, find out what kind of week you've all had and what's happening with you. So there you are. So a good dinky do to you. Hello, Gordon Sterling. Lovely to have you with us. Scotty, it's been a while since Louis Faber. Louis, we must be septic. I was thinking about you last week, and I thought, I haven't heard from Louis for far too long. Are you still in London, old chum? Do let us know. Ernie Ross, Robert Knight, Raymond Benson. Hi, Scotty. Hi, Ray. Dinky do to you. Lovely to have you with us. And um, what night is this, says Gordon Sterling. This is tonight, Gordon. Now, Matron will tell you that if you go and ask her, and you can say, what what night is this? All right. Dinky do the legend Scotty McClue, DJ Maximus, exit Henry Anderson, Susan Forrest from Lancashire, Dinky do. Welcome, welcome. We touch of the Largy tonight, so the voice isn't as strong as it could be. John Hanlon, Louis Faber still in London, very tense down here politically. Well, it will be till they dump this Brexit stuff. Natalie's listening. Good evening from me and Pablo, says El Salvador. Mark Gibson, hello, Scotty, dinky do. Hello, my friend, says the wonderful John Hanlon. Dinky do, John. And uh, Jamie Buffery will just ban you. Lifetime ban. And there's Jimmy. Away, we're going to get some idiots tonight, so off they go. The bonnet is here, Brian, but I've decided not to wear it, but it's here. So if you get stuck, we can always pop the bonnet on. Not a problem. Waving to people tonight. And uh, can you say good night to? Who am I saying good night to? Uh, good to see you, sir. So John Hanlon and you, John, of course. Uh, we're waving to people tonight. Say good night to Agnes. She's away for a bath. And a shave, says Gordon Stilling. Quite right, too, Gordon. You don't want to have the old rough neck around. Good evening, Scotty, says Vone. Way I work at Newcastle is the place to be, says Seamus Kelly. And uh, Seamus Kelly, any 12, absolutely. Hi, Scotty, no deal. All the way, great Gallagher. You need to do drop that. Forget it. A lot of nonsense. Surprised you're not watching the Tartan Army versus the Kremlinites. Louis, you know I don't follow football. So there we are. Derford Hunter, we'll just have to give you a lifetime ban. There we are. You'll never hear from him again. Lifetime ban. Some idiot. We're getting a few half-wits. When you do a live pop-up, you do get this from time to time, I dare say. Now, what kind of week have you all had? Have you had a tremendous week? Do tell. Spill to McClure what's been happening, I say. Excellent stuff. And come on and give me the benefit of your chit-chat. And uh, lots of tap, 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 tapity tap. Tremendous stuff. Um, Northern Irish accent, I can tell. Not Scottish, says Jason Kilshaw. Have you not got a Scottish accent, Jason? Good evening, Scotty. Hope all is well with you. Stephen Menzies. What half-wits? We're all half-wits. Louis Faber. We are not half-wits. We are very sensible people. So there we are. What have we got here? What nonsense am I getting? Although no deal would be a disaster, we need the possibility of the table. When the PM goes to negotiate Brexit, we don't want to negotiate Brexit. Nobody wants to leave. We are remaining. So there you go. Fantastic. Berta King Patton. Love it. Hi, Scotty. Scotland up 1-0. First Lord of the Internet. Scotland, Russia. Come on, the Scots. No deal all the way. Agree with this chap. Louis Faber. What would be the point in coming out of the European Union after 50 years of peace and prosperity? Alan Morrison, dinky you do. Lovely to have you with us. A much for a chin. Ben Newman, I do not chin people. I am a man of peace. Uh, so there we are. Liam Doherty is calling on Luke Fulham to join us. Dinky do. Scotty McClure popping up just for you. And uh, I hope you've had a super week. Do tell. First Lord of the Internet here and the world's top broadcaster. Uh, make sure you share.
and share it, share it, share it with all this. Very important. Let people know what is what. Wonderful. You're a good man, McClure. A bit of a partisan, says Craig Gallagher. No, no, not at all, Craig. I only like what's best for my country. And uh, staying in the EU is best. Lord McHugh is watching. Uh, <laughs> Stephen Mooney, thank you do. And Ian Kerr, lovely to have you with us, Ian. Welcome, I say. Just going to get my water, a wee bit of a throat tonight. And I did want to pop up and see you all. I thought it was very important. We'll have greater prosperity outside the EU. No, Louis, we won't. That's the whole thing. So there you go. And anti-democratic MPs. These 21 MPs this week should be knighted or given damehoods if they're a lady. So there we are. That would be fantastic. Scotty has put the broad in broadcasting, says John Hanlon. I did, John. How would you explain we got confused over the result, though? We do say we were voting on Eurovision. Uh, lol, says John Hammond. Lol. Very easy to get confused. Evening, Scotty, my friend. I think it was a party political stunt that went horribly wrong for the Conservatives. That's what's happened there. And uh, Alistair Scott Schubert. Falkirk is watching camera. Ooh. Sharing at the moment, says John Boyle. I should hope so, John. Uh, Lauren Mill Spence. Lovely. Maya Spence. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClure. Vodka, says John Boyle. No, that is not a vodka, John Boyle. That is aqua. Ooh. Oh. That is lush. It's so good. Lisa Anderson, dinky do. Welcome to Scotty McClure's pop up just to say hi to every nation. World unity. Horribly wrong. So explain why the Tories are still pulling higher than other parties. Well, I can explain that through the fact they're not. Uh, Nicholas Sturgeon, Ambassador Scott, not at all. Long live the union. No, no, no. I can see that ending. I mean, you know, they need to uh, sort things out. Uh, Louis Faber, you have to stay on. So there you are. So I'll not mention that. One buddy, says John. Dinky do, John. Lovely to have you with us and a very warm welcome. Uh, Martin Rose watching. Can we have a good few thumbs up and a good few hearts for Scotty McClure? Dinky do. Very, very important. Yes, it looks like we will be remaining within the EU just the way things are going. Okay, we'll do, says John Boyle. Certainly, John. Dinky do from Scotty McClure. Christopher Love. Keith Wotherspoon. Kimmy Bailey Lockyer. Hello. Hello, Kimmy. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky do. And <laughs> Luke Byrne. <laughs> <laughs> Look, don't be harsh now. We've got to be fair. Very, very interesting. I mean, there was Boris Johnson riding very, very, very high last week, and then suddenly, boom, down he comes. I think there's vodka in the glass, Scotty. You're wrong, Brian Murphy. There's not. There you go. Fantastic. Tidied myself up. Bit of a fresh trim here. So there we are. Good. That's the way we like it. Now, if you can all get sharing, that would be superb. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 about Scotty McClure on. The aunt, says Lisa Anderson. Absolutely, Lisa. Uh, so there we are. Uh, what have we got here? Ryan Jack Jolly. What nonsense are you talking? Uh, the Tories are polling. Look at every poll that's come out says Boris took over. Who's that? Is that you and your granny? Um, he's very popular. Oh, yes, he seems to be. Um, people like that and a leader of the electorate want, the electorate want us to remain in the EU. So there we are. Fantastic. Now, Finlay, what are we doing with Finlay? I think we'll give Finlay a lifetime ban. Bye, Finlay. There we are. Excellent stuff. Jeff Bernstein and Sean Garachty. Dinky do. Welcome to Scotty McClure's pop up. Scotty, are you right wing or left wing? Tom Skelding, I'm totally apolitical. I have zero agenda. I just want what's best for all of you. 
But see some of the abuse I've put up with for telling the truth this week. Oh, people don't like the truth. Dinky do, Scotty, says Jeff Bernstein. Dinky do, Jeff. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, thoughts on abortion, Scotty? I think, Joel, we should change the term to termination. And I think it very much depends on the circumstances. Very difficult to generalize. I know organizations like the Roman Catholic Church will actually uh, generalize on it, but I don't think we should do. So there we are. Summer. Mm, what we'll do is block summer. There we go. Summer's away. Can you explain how you keep your hair so short? Well, of course, I have a thick shock of dark hair. And what I do is I use a dye called Silver Fox to make me look older and more distinguished. And I blend my hair in with the top of my head. What happened is I grew very tall and I actually grew through my hair. So they are. <laughs> What's this about? Don't go on about that, Louis, for goodness sake. Uh, we don't want any of that. So there we are. Is that lip filler? Where, Richard? Have you got some? So there we are. Um, right. Louis, you're about to get a lifetime ban. You need to stop that. So there you are. Just tipping you the wink, Louis, because there are, um, you know, hundreds and hundreds of people have just been lifetime banned for coming on too much nonsense. So that stuff. And don't be advertising aisles. So come on, Louis. You have to play the game. You of all people should know the score. So there we are. In fact, did you not know somebody that got banned and we, we allowed them back because of your good offices? There we go. There's Joe. Joe, you're going to get a lifetime ban. Lifetime ban for Joe Block. Wonderful. We love this. Petrus, lifetime ban for Petrus. There we go. Excellent. Right. That's that. Now, um, Get Boris Johnson just shows you blah, blah, blah. I don't know what you're on, but there. Scotty, I went to some of the abuse you suffered on social media this week. There was no need. We all have our opinions. And um, it's very funny when people call me thick <clears throat> because I have two degrees, an IQ of 164 and 50 years experience of international affairs, politics, economics, all that sort of stuff. Uh, can someone just explain what it's about? I'm so confused. No, Louis, we can't risk explaining what it's all about. So there you are. Best county in Scotland is Ayr. There's somebody saying Ayr is the best county in Scotland. We like that. So there we are. Now, we may be disappearing. I think we've got a wee problem here with, uh, <laughs> has everything gone dark with you? There we go. Richard Glover, what we'll do is we'll block Richard. Okay. Excellent stuff. He's gone. What do you think of Brexit? I think we should dump it as soon as possible. Maybe one of your listeners can. No, we don't want to, Louis. You're not listening. Lol. Says Luke Bradbury. There we go. Uh, thank you, Sharma. And um, who have we got here? Robert Mitchinson. Lifetime ban. There he goes. Excellent stuff. Uh, so there you go. Hi, sir. How are you, says Thakura? Excellent, Thakura. Thank you for coming on. And dinky do. I think we might have a wee problem here, guys. Let me see what's happening. Um, oh, oh. Right. We'll see if we can get this going again. Uh, can you see me? Have I gone back? So finally, aha. Yes. Is it all coming back? I say. Do let me know. Apparently, we've got a power problem. Guys, eggs, potato, wonderful. Scotty McClure. So Oscar will give you a lifetime ban. That's it. There's Oscar away. And uh, Lord, you're a Corbin puppet. Tom Skelding, absolutely not. I am apolitical, right? And I've been accused of being so far to the right, so far to the left, so much in the centre, all these things. Uh, can see you know props. Hi, Scotty Dinky Do. Dinky Do. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, we seem to have a little problem, but you say you can see us. Am I clear? Is the lighting all right? And um, hello, Mr. Scotty, you're looking good, says Alan Joyce. Uh, you've lost half your hair, says John Mason. No, I've gained 
half my hair. And a lot less than this. And um, why is your head so shiny? Because <coughs> it's brand new. It's just out the bubble wrap. My apologies to Storm Scalding. I should think so. Uh, Russia just scored. So there we go. Finley Wallace, Stinky do. Are you okay, pal? Alexander. Uh, so there we are. Let's have a sofa, says Nathan. Nathan, lifetime ban. Are you ready? Bye. There we are. There's Nathan away. Tremendous stuff. And uh, that's what we like. Somebody told me you met Mussolini, says Ray Faber. No, we didn't meet Mussolini. Far too young for that. But I do remember watching Captain Corelli's Mandolin. So they are. Why do you brag about banning? Does it make you feel better? No, Ian. We've got idiots on here. And if we ban them, then they've gone. Do you understand? It makes everyone feel better. So there we are. Scotty Rate, you're a thick boy. Yes. IQ of 164. Two degrees, 50 years experience in international affairs, politics, economics, studying all that to a very high level. 40,000 hours of live broadcasting on television and radio. So what about yourself, Jake? Would you like to tell us what you've done? That would be terrific. Uh, listening to Mr. Martin last week, says Carl Morris, still makes me laugh. Very funny, Mr. Martin. If you go into Scotty McClue's YouTube channel and put Scotty McClue talks to Mr. Martin, you will get a smile. Scott Smith, dinky do. Can everybody share, guys? Share, 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 share. Legend, says Alistair Gillespie. You too, Alistair Gillespie. Cameron Erach, hi Scotty, what's your recommendation for a nice holiday in Scotland? Get yourself to the Isle of Mull, yes, and uh, get yourself onto a fabulous big hotel there, um, Tyroran House, that's the one, and you will have the holiday of a lifetime, so they are terrific stuff. Wonderful hotel. I've stayed at all these wonderful hotels. Very, very lucky. Replying to Cameron Erich, Dundee. So there you are. Yes, you can get a holiday in Dundee, I believe. In GIF, says Jake. No, no, no. In height and brain power, Jake. So there, you're not very bright, Jake, are you? I have to say, Tom Skelly's laughing. Well played, Scotty. Um, what are you doing tonight, says Ian? I'm talking to you. Has that escaped your notice? Very important. There are lost village. So replying to you, your mum, share, do you believe, says Joe. How much for the picture? Not for sale, Jonathan. There you are. Cheers, Scott, you're crying now, says Joe. Well, I'm not surprised, Joe, but you've upset yourself. And uh, co-winning is nice at this time of year. How good is a tatty scone? says Emma G. Emma G, we like tatty scones. They are very, very good. Wonderful stuff. And uh, Lily Patterson, are you on the radio on Sunday? Yes, Nation Radio, 10 o'clock sharp, Sunday night. Be there or be square. 96.3 on the FM in central Scotland or www.nationradio.scot or you can say to your smart speaker, Alexa, play Nation Radio Scotland. Wonderful. Lost Village, uh, I'd like to purchase Raquel Del Carmen Rodriguez. You're about to be banned. Lifetime ban. There you are, that's the end of her. Don't go to Scotland. There's a nice, don't, don't go to Scotland. There's a nice holiday for you. Jordan Merson. What are you talking about? Never heard so much nonsense in my life. Just all that. There we go. Excellent. We get these silly pop-up ads and in the interview with the broadcast. Uh, John Danbury will ban you. Lifetime ban for John. There he goes. Never hear of him again. You sell Kenny Power. Lifetime ban. We'll never hear of you again. Fantastic. There we are. There's Kenny away. Tom Skelton's laughing. The Isle of Arran is good for a break, says Brian Murphy. 
Yes, very nice. Right. I think you're going to Syria with the kids. How is it, pal? Says Joe Carter. I haven't been, Joe. <coughs> I do know that it's very, very nice, but I haven't personally been. A lot of belters here tonight. Glad they're being blocked, says Lisa Anderson. Oh, Lisa, you've got to block these whistles. Otherwise, they could, um, you know, reduce the quality of the broadcast. And we can't have that, can we? So there we are. It's all about us, remember? Uh, unite the clans and Storm Fife. Ricardo, uh, barbecue sauce on your tatties. No, no, butter. Lily Patterson, Jeff Bernstein, and 19 others are watching of my friends. Can we all share? Every single one of you watching right now, click share. And share with as many people as you possibly can. The East End of Glasgow is lovely for an evening stroll. So I would believe, Tom Skelding, uh, that's not totally apparent. You seem a bit bold and drunk, says Jake Verstek. Bold and drunk. Would you like to explain the boldness I can accept? That's a fact. Where do you get the drunk from? That would be interesting. So tell us a bit more about that. Maybe you are drunk yourself. Uh, who have we got here? Hello, Mr. Scotty. Looking good, my man. Says Alan Joyce. I thank you, Alan. So are you, and dinky do. We glass of water for the main man here. Oh, that is lush. Fiona MacDonald. Hi, Scotty. What's up, hottie? Says Janelle. Um, Thomas Hamilton. Hello, pal. Hello, Tom. And scream. Uh, what, Salvatore, what we'll do with you, we'll just block you, I think. Have you had a good day, says Thomas Hamilton. I have, Tom. Lovely day. Thank you very, very much for that. Can everybody keep sharing and sharing? Tap, 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 tap. Share, says Ricardo. Thank you, Ricardo. Excellento. Hi, friend, says Lauren My Spence. Hi, Lauren. Dinky do. Jordan Mason. Jordan Mason or Mason Jordan says, say please. Say please to what? What would I want? Do I be saying please to? Jochel Habiga says, why he look like Mr. Gorbachev? Thank you. That's a compliment. I like Mr. Gorbachev. So there we are. And uh, Connor, we'll have to ban you. So there we are. That's Connor A. Why are you so desperate for attention, says Lauren? Well, I'm not Lauren. I'm just popping up. I mean, if you want to watch, that's great. If you don't, you don't have to. So I'm not desperate for anything. All right, lovey. There you are. Did you get that? Fantastic. Uh, why? You, sir, look like Mr. Gorbachev. Yes, thank you. We've done that bit. Um, so there we are. Emma G. Uh, good evening, Scotty. This is Robert T. Kerr. A wise man, Robert. <coughs> Pardon me. Lisa says, is Kirkintilloch in Glasgow? It is a Glasgow postcode, but people say it's not Glasgow. Do you know, Scotty? Uh, Kirkintilloch. Is that not just edging in Stirlingshire? I'm just wondering, Kirkintilloch. Might have a Glasgow postcode, but then again, you see, so does Renfrewshire and Lanarkshire. I mean, Glasgow is actually in Lanarkshire. They are fantastic. So how's the dog doing? He's beautiful. I just came here, says Jake. Jake, we will just lifetime ban you, La. There's Jake away. Excellent stuff. Uh, and there's Liz, Liz, Liz Jane. Liz will just say bye-bye. Big ban for Liz Jane. We'll never hear of her again. Oh, she's gone. There we are. And Ricardo. Just let you away. There we go. Just block you a few folk. Hello, Scotty from Glasgow. So David Russell, dinky do, David. Lovely to have you with us. And welcome, 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 I say. Wonderful. Um, hi, I'm new. So there we go, Louis. I told you not to do that. I'll just, what I'll do, Louis, is I'll delete your comment. 
So there you are. Lost Village, very nice.